Yoga is very effective in preventing and curing diseases as proven by many researches. But one must consult doctor before practicing yoga and practice under supervision of a yoga teacher. Along with yoga, healthy eating habits and certain food items also help in preventing and curing diseases. Gastric Problems Asanas Shashankasan Supta Pavan Muktasan Supta Vajrasan Halasan Mayurasan and Padhastasan Pranayama Bhastrika and Kapalbhati Shashankasan Bend your legs at knees and sit on your feet with toes touching and heels supporting the hips. Raise both the hands upwards with palms facing the front. Move your trunk forward, place your forehead on the ground and hands around the head with palms resting on the floor. Shashankasan helps in reducing excess fat around stomach, helps in reducing back pain, navel center problems and removes body stiffness, helps in curing heart diseases, cures constipation, gastric problems and spondylitis. Supta Pavan Muktasan Lie down on your back, keeping the legs straight. Bend the right leg at knee and move it on top of chest. Tightly coil both the hands around the bent right leg and raise head above floor, bringing it closer to right knee. Repeat it for other side. Supta Pavan Muktasan Improves blood circulation in legs and helps in curing joint pains. Strengthens legs and hips. Cures acidity, digestive problems, diabetes, gastric problems high blood pressure and spondylitis, improves digestive system and helps in reducing back pain. Supta Vajrasan Bend your legs at knees and sit on your feet with toes touching and heels supporting the hips. Placing the elbows on the floor, move your tongue backwards and place your head on the floor. And lift your trunk so that entire body is balanced on feet and head. Now place hands on the thighs with palms resting on thigh. Supta Vajrasan addresses all problems related to neck, strengthens back, legs, knees, thighs and reduces any pain there, helps in reducing fat, reduces the bad odor of sweat and cures gastric problems. Halasan Lie on your back keeping the legs straight and hands straight at the sides with palms facing floor. Without bending the legs, lift your legs and move beyond the head till the toes touch the floor. Move hands and hold the toes of both the legs with both the hands. Stay in this position, breathing normally for a comfortable duration. Halasan makes the spinal cord flexible, helps in reducing belly and removing gas from the stomach, improves blood circulation of the body, strengthens neck and shoulders, improves eyesight, cures menstrual disorder and obesity. Mayurasan, keeping the knees shoulder width apart, sit on your toes, join your elbows and adjust elbows under the navel. Place your palms on floor with fingers pointing away from body towards left and right side. Lift your knees and legs balancing the body weight on elbows. Now stretch your legs like feathers of peacock and stay in this position for a comfortable duration breathing normally. Mayurasan alleviates all digestive system related problems and tones abdominal organs. It's good exercise for liver and pancreas and cures diabetes. Mayurasan improves eyesight and strengthens arms and lungs. People suffering from high blood pressure and hernia should not practice. They can practice after these diseases are cured through medication and practice of other yoga asanas. Padhastasan Stand erect with your feet together and bend forward without bending your knees and place your hands on either side of the legs with palms touching the ground. Now move your head closer to legs so that forehead is touching the legs. Padhastasan removes shoulder and back pains, reduces fat and trims waist, strengthens thighs and makes spine flexible, helps in increasing height, cures backache, constipation, diabetes, gastric problems and obesity. 
people suffering from acute back problems should not practice they can practice after these diseases are cured through medication and practice of other yoga asanas consult doctor before practicing and practice under supervision of a yoga teacher namaste ka pranayam is performed sitting in padmasan or sukhasan it is performed by inhaling and exhaling through nostrils keeping the mouth closed inhale slowly through nostrils expanding your chest and exhale normally through your nostrils this is how it is performed Bhastika pranayam is very effective in removing respiratory system diseases like bronchitis, cough and cold and other lung diseases. It also removes impurities from your chest and nose. It also cures depression, diabetes, hives and pyrrhea. Kapalbhati pranayam is performed sitting in padmasan or sukhasan in kapalbhati pranayam inhale through nostrils and exhale through nostrils keeping the mouth closed inhale normally through your nostrils and exhale slowly through your nostrils contracting your abdominal muscles this is how it is performed kapalbhati pranayam is very helpful in removing digestive system related diseases like constipation gastric trouble and other digestive system diseases it also cures diabetes depression and pyrrhea helpful tips chew two cloves of garlic and two raisins after every meal teaspoon of ajwain also known as ajwain in hindi and black salt powder in equal quantities after every meal